Barbie girl and welcome to a new video. Today we are doing a scary kind of video. The title of the story is Blackout and we are gonna read it together. Let's go. Haley said, dude, did your electricity just go out? And Ashley responded, nope, the storm's not too bad over here. Yours? Yeah, I'm pretty terrified right now. You do know this is like how 70% of horror movies start. Oh my god, it's a storm. Are you home alone? Will you be my guide through this obvious nightmare I'm currently experiencing? Haha, ha, of course. What am I even supposed to do without electricity? How did people live like this? I can't see anything. Go light some candles or something. See if you can find a flashlight. All of my candles are lit and it just looks so much more terrifying. No, it should look... Romantic. Like, I'm having some sort of seance. What is that? Or something. Ah, oh, I'm so bored. I know the feeling. I hate when there is no electricity in the house. It'll be fine. All right, Ashley. Did I like read a book or just sit in a corner surrounded by flames until my mom gets back? Where did she even go with the weather like this? Who knows? She's been acting so strange these past few months. How? Like how she acted before my dad was sent away. Sent away where? She's just been so paranoid about everything and like incredibly sad. You mean more than usual? Way more than usual. Why? I thought that she was doing so much better since she started dating that businessman with the 1940s haircut. <laughs> she was until she broke up with him a couple of weeks ago. Now she has become some weird type of hermit that will only leave the house to go grocery shopping every so often. Haha, <laughs> what do you mean? Since she ended the relationship with Mike, now every weekend instead of being wined and dined, she just stares out our front window through the blinds, then remembers we need milk. She might be going crazy. Oh my god, I have to pause a bit. What? Imagine if your mom was like just looking through the window. Really? Yeah, I mean, last night I watched her walk back and forth to make sure that all of the windows and doors were shut and locked at least 13 times before she went to bed. Paranoid. P.S. I'm still in awe of our ancestors for living without the beautiful things called electricity. <laughs> Thank you, Benjamin Franklin! Hell yeah! She sounds like my mom after she binge watches those awful crime shows. Well, that's another thing. For real, it's like she's waiting for Michael Meyer Myers to come to my... <sighs> Let's move on. She's either losing her mind or she's hiding something from me, including all of the flashlights. I can barely see anything right now. Open up some of the blinds. Duh! Smart thinking, Ash! You don't say. <laughs> Just stay away from the windows. I think we are under a tornado warning. That's weird. What is? Our house is the only one on the street that has no power. Oh my god. Maybe it wasn't the storm's fault. Maybe there's something wrong with your circuit breaker. Or maybe my mom conveniently forgot to pay the power bill. I don't even know what a circuit breaker is. Hurry up, mom! Why are you telling that to Ashley? Oh wait, I think she's here. Finally! Did she get the lights turned back on? Hello? I said hello before even Ashley said hello. Hey, Leah! Where are you? I could have sworn I heard the front door open. Is she not home yet? No, and I'm officially freaked out. You might just be hearing the wind. Have you tried calling her? Duh, no, not yet. What? Call her, maybe she's just stuck in traffic. All right. Dude, wait, wait. She didn't answer. The first thing you do is like call someone you're worried is not home like your mother i'm starting to get a little paranoid over here oh just like your mother just breathe i'm sure she's all right do you need me to come over i keep hearing footsteps downstairs i think someone is here it's probably her just go check again 10 minutes later is she home just let me know if everything's all right i'm leaving to come to your house in five minutes if you don't respond she's here oh Good, she will... Oh, that was fast. Good, she'll get the lights on soon. Everything will be alright. And we can start trying to find your mom a new man. Maybe someone with an 1890s mustache. <laughs> mustache. Something weird is going on. 
What? My mom just told me to go to my room and lock my door. She's never done that before. She's probably just paranoid about the store. I don't know. She was acting weird. Weirder than normal. I think she's screaming at someone. <gasps> On the phone? I think someone else. I can't tell what's going on. Are you in the room? Is it bad? I don't know. I can't tell. I can't hear them. I have to go downstairs to check. Listen to your mom, Haley, and stay in your room. She's screaming. Should you call the cops? Something broke. Oh no. I keep hearing glass hit the floor. Maybe it's the storm. Just stay calm. Ashley, no. Tell him to call the cops. I can hear her crying. I think she's hurt. I need to help her. I don't know. I'm calling the police right now. They should be at your house soon. Stay in your room and make sure the doors are locked. Keep in contact with me until we get there. I don't know. It's quiet now. I can't hear her anymore. No. Something's wrong. I have to go check on her. Not now. <gasps> Haley, stay where you are. I can't hear footsteps. <coughs> Someone's coming up the stairs. Stay quiet, Haley. The police said they will be there as soon as possible. He knows my name. He knows me. Haley, don't move. The cops should be there any moment. Please just stay safe. Haley, are you alright? My God, guys, please tell me that you are alright. She's not answering. It's my dad. Wait, he was sent away. Your dad? I thought he lived in Canada or something. What are you talking about? Oh my God, he's out. Out? Was he crazy? Out of where? Was he in the mental jail? For what? What? What are you talking about? Hey. He found us. Oh no! Is there a second part to this, guys? Please. What happened to Haley? What happened to her mother? I love how hooked they keep me. Like, honestly, this app represents exactly what hooked me. And that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I am still shocked and scared about Haley and what's going on. Talk to you later. Stay awesome. Bunny girls out. Bye-bye. Ciao.